Hello, this is Yurka from Revo.com and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to work with our Revo PBR Loader add-on inside the Blender. So if you installed our add-on you can find it here in the material properties and if you scroll down you can find here Revo PBR Loader. So to upload our materials you just have to hit the browse button and find the folder with Revo materials. So you can open it like this and you can see all materials are listed here. If you click on the material you can even see little previews here which can help you navigate through the list. Also, you can select all materials or just the ones you want to upload. If you add something new to the folder, you can refresh the list via this button. Or if you have stored some materials in different folder and you would like to add them to the list, you can do it by clicking on this button. And in the end, you can clean the list by this button. So there are also some options which you can choose from, for example, to upload also the ambient occlusion map or displacement map or for some higher resolution renderings, the displacement maps and normal maps in 16 bit depth. And what is really important is here this checkbox conform maps to image dimensions. It means if you have the texture with non square ratio, it will preserve the ratio of the original texture. And in the end, you can also choose what type of mapping the material will have on the uh, on the object so right now i will select all materials and i will load them by this button and after upload you can find all materials uh, listed here and they are loaded into uh, this list so what is also the nice feature of this plugin is that if you check just one material so i will unselect them and i will check for example this floor i can even apply the material on selecting object by this button so i will apply it like this and if i will change the shading you can see material is applied on the object and it looks really nice so uh Last thing what I want to show you is when I go to the shader editor and I will apply the material with non-square texture and this is this Gabion stone wall so I'll uncheck this and check this Gabion stone wall and I will hit apply material on selected object. You can see if I go to this material like this uh, yeah that the texture has uh, different than the square ratio and this checkbox preserve the ratio here in the scale so I can for example mul multiply it by 3 and multiply it by 3 and it still preserve the ratio of the original texture image so this is all for this add-on right now we are working on new features for the blender stay tuned don't forget to subscribe to our channel hit the bell button and the like thank you for watching